Hey y'all. Don't make fun of my pillow, bitch. Wait, let me fix this. It's too bright out here for this. Hold on. As you guys know, every time I wear my glasses in my videos, that means I'm drinking. But I'm not like a drunk. Drunk. Ooh, it's so bright outside. All right, that'll do because if I do anything else, I'm gonna get start getting mad because I ain't getting the light and right. So if y'all get a little of this, this glare thing that's going on, then y'all just get a little glare that's going on. I'm just trying to make sure the lighting is right. The lighting is right. Anyway, you guys, I got like a. I didn't go to bed last night to almost close to four o'clock in the morning because I as soon as I got home from work. I started to do my laundry. I came home, took a shower, and did some laundry. I did two loads. I washed some white clothes, and I washed my dark clothes. So that's what I did last night, early this morning when I got home from work. And I woke up this morning. Honestly, my sister and I was supposed to go to prayer, but we both woke up late. And plus, I don't think I would have been able to go. I would have probably forced myself to go. I would have forced myself to go, but... <sighs> She said she woke up late, so we were supposed to be there at 7, a little bit before 7 in the morning. So, I think prayer in, starts at 7. But, um, today, um, we're about to have breakfast. I'm enjoying me a mimosa. It is not even Sunday morning, but who cares? I'm enjoying me a mimosa. I did drink some water before I drank this. I have just a little piece of bacon in my, in my system. Last night, my sister made some chicken fettuccine alfredo, and this morning I ate some. That's another thing I did when I got home. I ate some chicken fettuccine alfredo, like, around almost close to 2 something in the morning. And I did some laundry. And, um, um, that's it. I was tossing and turning. Plus, them cats, Kiwi and Spider, kept running in and back and forth in my room going. And it's like, y'all better stop that. I'm trying to go to sleep. I already got to get up. But we didn't end up making it to prayer. As you can see, I'm here. Um... What I was going to say, yeah, today, I don't really have nothing planned today. I think I might I'm gonna make these smaller because I can't handle the bigness. I mean, sometimes I like to purposely wear long braids because I like people's reaction when they look at my braids. That's the only reason why I like long braids is so people can see my reaction. Plus, they're easy to take out. Look how big they are. They're going to be easy to take out. But I'm going to do the, um, I'm going to take them out, make them smaller, probably like maybe shoulder length or maybe a little longer. I'm just going to make them smaller so they can be a little lighter, you know? Um, and that's what I'm going to be working on today and tomorrow. And then maybe, oh, I don't have time to work on it Monday. Mm. I got school on Monday. But anyway, you guys, um, my mom and my sister from the high desert was supposed to be visiting this weekend, but they had other um, prior obligations, I guess, so they couldn't make it. So they couldn't make it so um, that's that I don't even know what we was gonna have planned today anyway what I don't, I'm sorry it just froze I was saying I don't even know what we was gonna have planned anyway but maybe if it's hot enough I'll probably go swimming if not I'm just gonna probably relax you guys like I said I didn't get enough sleep this morning I came home from work I just did the laundry and everything and I didn't go to bed to close to four this morning because I just couldn't sleep and I changed my bedding. I'm about to wash my blankets probably later on today. I gotta go to Michael's and get some more art supplies because I thought my art, buying art supplies, I thought it was all over with. I already bought art supplies almost two weeks ago. Okay, I got up early on that Saturday, caught the train all the way to um, North Hollywood so I can get my art supplies. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to Michael's today. My sister's gonna take me to Michael's and I'm going to get just like another art book with white paper. You know, the drawing Canson for those. The XL. Was it XXL? Canson or something like that. And that's it. As far as pencils, I'm not. No. Okay? No. Because right now we're just working on charcoal, which I love. Because I, th I think I draw better with charcoal. Again, what I was saying in my last video, I will have to put together like a little slideshow. So y'all can see some of the artwork that I've already done. Now when it comes to actually 
painting and all that. I'll probably show y'all, I'm mean, not painting, drawing with charcoal. I'll probably show y'all a little bit of that. Because what we're doing too is um, we are sharpening down some charcoal so that way we can do some charcoal drawings with the chamois. That's what we're doing. And I think I might finish my chamois drawings today because we did just a little sketch just to see how it was to draw with your chamois in class. And I think I might finish it because I, I like where it's going. So I think I'm going to finish it. I did three and I like where, where it's going. So I think I'm going to finish it. We're learning shadowing and lighting and all that. So we're, you know, and then this week coming in, we're going to be learning features because our next homework is going to be to draw somebody in class, like a portrait of them. They have to sit for the whole class. And the next class, we just switch. And it, like, for instance, if I'm drawing you, you'll be sitting for almost two hours and however long the class is. And then the next class, I'll be sitting and you'll be drawing me. So that's that's what we have to do. That's the next homework. That's due not this Thursday, but next Thursday. Or Thursday before next or whatever. I think we got three weeks. That's, that's not going to be due until three weeks. So on my first project that I did, which is the self-portrait, with the, which was the collage, I did, I got a B plus on that. Okay, I understand I didn't have the proper paper, whatever. This other project that I did with the contour lines that we had to do is the self-portrait with contour lines. I got a B on that. Just give me an A minus, you know what I mean? If the next project I get a B, I'm, I'm a tail. Anyway, you guys, um, I'm just going to be chilling this weekend pretty much, just redoing my hair and sanding down some more charcoal and going to the art store, blah, 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 yakety, schmackety. Who remembers that and where's that from? Blah, 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 yakety, schmackety. Comment below if you remember where that's from. Amber Lambs is just ruining this video. Okay, anyway, so that's all what's going to be taking place. We're having grits and bacon for lunch. Um, I mean, for breakfast. I may not even eat lunch because um, if I do eat lunch, it's going to be like a, probably a salad from Subway or something very small. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um... I don't know what else to say, but I'm just going to chit-chat about whatever. I hope nobody calls me because I am recording from my phone. Um, lately, I've been watching a lot of Gator Martin's reaction videos to scary, to scary, true, you know, like when people, Mr. Nightmare or Chills or um, Darkness Prevails, he be reacting to their videos a lot. And I just love when he has popcorn. He makes popcorn look so freaking good. Especially when he be like, sup, though. And then he has the popcorn. And he's showing you. I agree. Whoever says kettle corn is not good, I should throw this drink up in your face. But I'm not going to do that because this is mimosa and I'm not. I'm tired of you. I love watching Gator Martin's videos. And I was even thinking about one day maybe going to like a haunted house one day just to see what it's like to experience, you know, some of that activity. And somebody said that, hey, you know, when you used to work overnight, did you used to hear things or see things? You don't see ghosts? Never seen ghosts, never seen anything, but I, sometimes I feel like I hear things. Like when I know I'm in a room by myself or when I know I'm in a certain building by myself, I will hear things. And sometimes, sometimes I will jump and go, hello? I'm like, you know what? <laughs> I used to tell myself, you tripping. And I used to like feel like I hear things when I'm at Universal Studios. But I worked in a building that was real close next to City Walk, so you're bound to hear anything. And that's what I thought I was hearing, but it wasn't that. Hopefully these nails will last until um, the 1st of October. 
that's when I'm getting my Halloween costume. You guys, I was supposed to get my Halloween costume this uh, September. Uh, I need some chapstick. September 1st, but I had art supplies I need to get. Um, because school just started. And I just couldn't, you guys. I had to pay rent, get groceries, and pay the um, Wi-Fi bill, all that other stuff. So, my phone bill. So, yeah, you know. There are certain things I just can't get. I may just get a little knickknacks and probably do my own costume. Because I've always wanted to be a clown. Ever since I was little. That was my costume to be. I always wanted to be a clown. So, I think I'm going to concentrate on doing that. Okay? Which means these will be out. Or maybe a little smaller so I can be able to fit the clown wig. Again, I will try to do um, go Halloween costume shopping with me and a try on for my Halloween costume. As like I'll make it one big video. So it's gonna be like a vlog slash try on. Halloween costume try on. Um, I don't like trying on things at that store because it gets it gets so raggedy and everybody's in there trying to buy stuff and it just get crowded at at times and all the good stuff is gone last year when i went to the halloween spirit store all the good stuff was gone and the costumes that were left were like 65 dollars to be a policeman if you wanted to be like an m m or just like a big old m m those things were like 23 dollars 30 dollars those costumes were whack then if you wanted to be some kind of warrior or toga party princess goddess type greek egyptian thing those things were like 60 50 to 60 dollars no, I'm not spending that much on no mother effing costume like that. No. You better go find your mind because you done lost it. Okay? That's that. With a little bit of money that I did get paid with a couple days ago, I got to get some more tissue. Some more tissue. Um, and all of that. So, um... I wish I could stop by Total Wines and get some, some stuff, you know, some some more drinks and stuff. Uh, my mom was mentioning one at one point uh, we should go to Bethmo and just stock up on beers and drinks and all kind of other stuff. So that way, when company comes over uh, on the weekends, when we need to really relax, we can, you know, have a little nice drink and just relax. Because I don't have drinks until the weekend, you know. Um... A couple of nights ago, I've been having a glass of wine just so I can go to sleep, but it doesn't get me drunk or it doesn't get me, like, acting a fooey. It just makes me kind of relax and go to sleep. That's it. Uh, what else? Um, I have shorts on, you guys, so don't think y'all, don't, don't sit up there and try to say that y'all saw something, okay? Y'all don't see nothing. Anyway, so that's pretty much what I got going on today. Now, tomorrow is a whole different story. The only thing I really want to be doing tomorrow is my hair after I come back from church. But I'm going to do as much as my hair as I can today. But I really do need to take a nap because I did not get no sleep and I'm starting to feel it, y'all. Y'all don't even know. I would go on a date today and just tell the guy that... um my mom and my sister couldn't make it because I was supposed to go on a date with this guy. But um, I said, hey, my mom and my sister are visiting, so I can't go. He sent me the shades emoji with the glasses, which is my favorite emoji because I have a lot of shades. Okay, I got 40 plus shades. And I'm thinking about buying some shades from Sharon She's So Fabulous, but um, I don't really know how to go about that yet, but I'll find out. But anyway, um, if she's still doing it. And plus, I got to consider the fact that, you know, time and whatever else she got going on. So I might just, just go ahead and just buy them from where I've been buying them from. Not nice in store. Anyway, so, um, <laughs> no, but these glasses actually came from AliExpress. I did a video about these a couple, maybe last month sometime, over a month ago. And I got another pair that's purple up here and pink down here. We may even go to the Dollar Theater today. We may, we may not. I'm not sure. I don't know. I hate the fact that summer's leaving, but I'm so happy. Again, for those of you who don't know, summer is my favorite season. But I can use some cold weather right now. As hot as it been. 
I could use some cold weather right now. The kind that is so cold outside, when you come home, you gotta take a shower, and then you gotta jump into bed, put on your pajamas, then jump in bed, then warm up the cold sheets and blankets. I hate cold sheets. Oh, I hate cold sheets. If it's already cold outside, that's another thing you need to know about me. I don't like cold sheets, blankets, pillowcases. No. If it's already cold outside, now during the summer, it, you know, I don't, I don't care. But in general, overall, I do not like cold sheets. Maybe a small percentage of me may appreciate it during the summer, but I don't like cold sheets. I don't like cold, cold pillowcases, none of that, especially when it's already cold. Okay? Now, the only way your bed can be warmed up is if you have to have warm-up blanket uh, thing to where it's like a little thing that's hooked onto the blanket to where you can set your temperature or your mattress could get warmed up or if somebody's in it and ain't nobody been in my bed but them damn cats and not in that way okay and ain't nobody been in that bed but me by myself so that's the only time I really appreciate cold sheets and blankets is if it's really super stupid hot outside. Miserably hot outside. I feel like it's got upset with us. The reason why it's been this hot. And I used to think he probably blow, blowing his breath going. <sighs> That's what I used to think when I was little. <laughs> I used to think when I was little. Jesus, God, and the Lord were three different people. Okay? So, you know, cut me some slack. You gotta excuse me, because for that, I just don't know better. But anyway, um, so, um, let's talk about nails. You know what I mean? I, after this set, I think I might just have this set on and then have it taken off. I'm going to get my long nails back. I miss my long nails. And a lot of people are like, how do you wipe your butt? Let me tell you something. Use wipes. Even with long nails. Use wipes. And if you want to go over it with tissue, go right ahead. But wipes get you that grip. You see what I'm saying? And you know what I mean when I go like this. Do not wipe like this. Please don't wipe like this. Don't, don't wipe like this. Okay? Because you're going to bring booty germs in your coochie and that's not the business. Not that I know what that's about, but you don't want to do that. You just want to wipe that way. Take that wipe and just like dig all up in it, buy the whole... I mean, I hate to get explicit, but you got to get it out. Especially when you got nails. You got to wipe extra, extra swipes. Because without nails or with short nails like mine, you'll be able to wipe like... Whoop. You know, some people get it on a first run. Some people got to make sure, look, I'm nowhere near a shower. Let me go ahead and just wipe as much as I can. If you have Walmart or something, that's what I'm saying. Wipe. Wipes help if you have long nails. And some people don't like that wet feeling. I get it. Not trying to be gross. Not trying to be gross. But some people don't like that feeling. So, And I totally understand. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and just get wipes. And, you know, that helps you, you know, when you have long nails. That helps you get everything. So after this said, I'm going to get some nails that's relating to Halloween. But I'm going to tell them, can you please give me clear nails so I can paint my nails myself? I did this design. I, I stuck with the glitter pink and black thing. For those of you guys who are Heart Foundation fans out there, Red Heart, this is, uh, this is not a, you know, this is not the kind of pink that he wears, but... I think they called him the pink and black attack or something like that. Him and Envil, I guess. I don't know. But they were at the Heart Foundation. And they were pink and black. But I didn't think about that when I was actually doing my nails. I just put on pink, black, and glitter. And this one is a glitter one. Fearless Femme Star. I love her What the Nail videos. Okay? Her What the Nail videos. And she makes me miss long nails, even though hers are real. I love her nails, you know, and how she's able to adapt to all kinds of stuff, pick up stuff, put on her airways, makeup, her wigs, or whatever it is. I'm like, how do you do that without breaking them damn nails? How do you do what you do when you do it? Sharon, she's so fabulous too. 
all that stuff she was doing her house, the the cleanup, the motivational cleanups. How do you? How does everybody out there with long nails, um, especially with lovely Mimi, you too? How do y'all not break your nails out of all the stuff you have to do? Cook, clean, do your hair, drive, pick up things, grocery shop. I'm not going to ask you how you wipe yourself because that is just a shitty question to ask somebody like that. And I'm sure y'all are tired of hearing that. So I'm not going to be that. Like, I, don't, I can't say I feel your pain with that because I don't have long nails. But at the same time, it's like, I would, pretty, I would get agitated if somebody asked me that. How do you wipe yourself? I just told you, wipes. How do you wipe yourself? So shut up and stop asking dumbass questions. So, um... So, yeah, I'm going to get my long nails back, and I'm going to make them, I'm going to start keeping my long nails, and I'm going to do, like, a Halloween theme to them, and I'm going to do Christmas, 4th of July, and I'm going to show you guys. It's going to be an inspired what the nail video, but I don't want to totally copy. I'm just going to do the show and tell. That's what I call my stuff. Like, whenever I do hauls from Dee Dee's Discounts and 99 Cent Store, I call it 99 Cent Store Hauls. I'll do show and tells on like these glasses. So I'm going to do a show and tell on my nails. Nail, show and tell. Boom. If somebody else got it already, then I'll just, you know, still call mine that, you know. What's in the name? You know, ain't nobody got no name or no rights to what they want to call these videos. So, and I want to start doing different things. You know, like I may do another drugstore makeup tutor tutorial. Everything vlogs and videos like that hauls tutorials is gonna be all on one channel I don't have the time or energy to be making a separate channel for vlogs and this channel for talking I got my eyes closed So I'm just gonna keep everything all on one channel It's just so you guys can see a variety of things coming from me, okay, and I also want to do a 20 question tag on and I'm, a, I'm just going to write some facts about me. 20 facts about me so you guys can know me in depth. Not so much in depth, but basic information. You know, because I keep saying I'm going to do that, but I never do it. Just so you guys can know basic information about me. You will not get my address, social security number, bank card statement. You can forget it. Um, okay, because I wouldn't be stupid enough to put that on my channel anyway. So, ooh. Shanene. Anyway. All right, you guys, I'm about to go have breakfast, finish this, because I'm feeling it right now. I'm drunk. So, <laughs> once again, this has been a tipsy chit-chat. Tipsy chit-chat. Chitty chit -chip, tipsy chit-chat. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for liking, subscribing, all my viewers. Thank you so much. I appreciate y'all. All the, um... People who viewed the videos as well, I appreciate all y'all. Okay, I appreciate the. I appreciate all of the. You know, and you know, don't talk to me like the. Anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and comment if you wish of things you would like to see me try to do. Again, I had a few things coming up. I want to do another drugstore makeup tutorial. I'm going to start doing my nails very long. And it's going to be not very long, but it's going to be longer than this, definitely. And I see it this way. I'm a custodian. As long as I can get my work done and get it done right, my nails can be as long as they want. It's when I start slacking that's the problem. It's like, maybe them long nails is in a way. Then I'll take them down, cut them down, or whatever the case may be. But I'm not the... Um, I'm not the only one at my job who has nails, but nobody's nails is going to be as long as mine. Because I'm going to make mine a little longer. Not longer than this. This hand is shorter than this hand. Because I do a lot of things with this hand. And plus, you know, with my fingers being like this, I bite them and all that. It pushes the cuticles way down. So these, um, these two fingers right here are super long. So that's why, another reason why the nails on this hand is a little bit longer. Because they has to kind of, you know. But anyway, um... Again, I got I got a show and tell, a nail show and tell that I'm be doing soon. Um, I may tape us going to Michael's, and I think my sister wanted to go to Amoeba's. I believe that's still a go. I'm not sure if that's a guard, but you know, I let you guys know. Uh, who watches Summer Heights High out there? 
I should make this a whole different video. But who watches Summer Heights High? Who? Chris Lilly is a genius for that shit. I love Summer Heights. My ex-boyfriend, he introduced me to Summer Heights High. Because he used to watch like all of Chris Lilly's Angry Boys, Summer Heights High, Smouse. I remember one time he went to a school, he was rapping, and Richard Lawson, which is Bianca Lawson's father, which is Beyonce's mom's new husband, he played his, because Chris Lee was playing a black man, and Richard Lawson played his father. So I guess they had an engagement to go to this one elementary school to rap about, to kids about something. And the first thing he said was, yeah, motherfuckers, at this little kid school, I think it was an elementary school, and these kids were looking like the fuck. Anyway, I'm really going off track because that's how you can tell that I'm pretty drunk. So anyway, you guys, this has been a tipsy chit chat. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to end the video here because this video would be an hour. You know. And um, thank you so much for watching. I've talked long enough. i got to finish this.